What is up guys, Politics Gaming here, and today we're going to be playing Power and Revolution today. Just so you know, yes, we are going to be continuing as a Republic of Turkey, as well as other projects that we are moving on. Um, but today we are going to be starting um, maybe, maybe a new series, uh, maybe not. Um, but we are going to be playing as an independent Texas today very interesting uh, concept that I have not seen done yet, uh, at least, at least specifically Texas, and I actually want to do a California uh, in the future or something like that. Uh, Texas and California would very, be very interesting independent states. <clears throat> um, what happened? Why is it not starting? Yeah, I know. Um, I was a little late. I was a little late trying to get things set up, and I also... Uh, um, thought I, I accidentally misjudged the time and I looked at it and I said oh it's 132 and then it took me a few more minutes uh, to uh, to get everything rolling and give me one more second and then I'll go ahead and switch this over thing on the road. Uh, let me turn that music down just a tiny bit. All right, should be good. Let's go ahead and get it, get it rolling. All right, and let's go ahead and transition this over. What is up? What is up? What is up? What is up? So essentially, how am I playing as an independent Texas? A lot of you guys might be asking that question. I already saw it being asked once. So let's go over here. Let's go over to modding. Let's go over to uh, modify a mod. And if the music is a little too loud, please let me know. So essentially, this is a mod ba made by myself. This is a mod ba made, by bleh, made by me. So essentially, the description is uh, Texas succeeds on the ballot in 2022 and Texas becomes an independent state, lead the new nation into the 2030s with a clear path. Will Texas embrace the changing world or stand against it? Let's go ahead and hit okay. This is just modifying the mod. We'll play as the mod in a second. Mod configuration. Is there any way to put myself on this? Let's do in the end. Texas, or no, Republic. We'll do 2023. Uh, let's hit apply there. Hold on, configuration. Let's go over here. And I'm still working on a mod. This is a mod. Uh made by me this is a mod very much made by me and uh i am still kind of like fine tuning it i mean this might not be like a part series this might be like like a different like a every single time you see this mod it's gonna be me starting it again so it's it's still being worked on so that is why don't get too excited over a series on this yet because I because I still want to go in and I want to add like specific cities right now the only other cities because like Amarillo is not here let me actually do this real quick so I'll show you guys how to add a city so we're gonna hit new we're gonna hit the green plus button and then we're gonna say Amarillo it's not the capital the, ca uh, the population of Amarillo is 
198,000. 198. And we will... Ah, come on. Damn it. I'm playing as the United States. Let's hit Texas. Cities, Austin, and you. And then we will do Amarillo. <clears throat> Population, 198. Location, there. Then we can actually zoom in. Watch it right here. Fly. Amarillo's there. Then, so I have Amarillo, I have Abilene. Actually, there's two separate cities. Abilene, I guess. Yeah, there's, yeah, there's two Abilenes. Not nation. Cities. I'm still not clicked on Texas. Cities. Why am I looking at Washington? we go! I don't want to die. Abilene, 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 Abilene. I guess this is just a weird bug. So then, you can actually go over here, you can edit the laws at the beginning. Essentially, the only big changes that I've done is that uh, Texas has a nationalization on uh, conventional and unconventional gas and oil. Um, no national service. Um, it's basically a lot of the laws are kind of in line with the United States, except that power of religion. We actually were going to move this to influence of the official religion in state functioning. And we'll hit apply. So that's actually what I missed. And then again, we'll get this on in a second. What's going on in chat right now? PG not studying the chat. I am. I am. I'm. <laughs> I've, I'm watching, trying to. I'm, I'm watching, trying to control what's going on. All right. Um. If you guys are gonna debate, if you guys are gonna about gonna debate about something, I do not mind y'all debating in my chat. Just keep things level. You guys can have a conversation without getting too heated. Otherwise, if you're going to have that kind of discussion and it's going to get like that, move it over to Discord or something like don't don't clog up my chat with with uh, the with a like a what do you call it <coughs> heated debate, I guess. Uh, all right, let's go ahead and go back. So if you actually go over to parties. This is why does this why does it keep doing this? Why does it keep doing this? Every time I try to let's do customize game, load, let's go to groups, you 
TR. It literally says it. So let's export Texas. Yeah, move it to Discord where we can send memes. Hell yeah. That yes. I'm gonna go over to parties again, and then this is what we have. So we have the Republican Party of Texas GOP. So it basically again replicates what's going on in the United States. However, there is a key difference: is that it is a part of the Texas Party, and I believe that if Texas were to get a independence like out of out of just the blue I believe that there would be um, some sort of there would be some sort of a I guess difference um, between them so yeah and they were there wouldn't be any other room for any sort of like a just big party yet so what I have right here is that we do have the Ultramondalist, the Alternative World Movement, and then we have the Committed Christians Movement. This is going to be... This has extreme rights. Still makes them the Committed Christians Movement. Liberal classes told me so. What is going on? A royalist, totalitarian. I think I'll put him in extreme right for right now. Results from the last elections. No, you guys haven't gotten crap from the last elections. wonder it's getting confused. Results from last elections to be assigned. So let's do... Okay, so let's go over here. No wonder this thing has been getting confused because it's like, I don't know what you're wanting. Percentage of the electorate, so let's put... Fifty-five seats, political leaning none. Then, Democratic Party of Texas. They're going to make up. That was fifty-three, so like forty-seven would be base. So let's go ahead and do forty. One point two seven. Then the committed Christians union or movement. So those from the last election zero. Let's make you about point two percent. Two point two. Point one six. Then the alternative world. We will make one point. One point zero nine percent. In Texas mainly Christian. Yeah, let me go back. Okay, so 
The difference between the Republican Party of Texas and the Committed Christians movement is this is this little thing right here. We have political position and political meaning. So I'm actually going to go into detail about these in that political ideology video. So what we have right here is political position. This is whether they're they're right, conservative rightist, extreme right, royalist, authoritarian, military, or center, or if they're communist, totalitarian, extreme left, or socialist, whatever. And then political leaning is whether they're mainly about ecology, if they're a regional group, if they're an altermondalist group, if they're an independence party, if they're Christian, if they're Catholic, Protestant, Orthodox, Muslim, Shiite, Sunni, Jew, Buddhist, or Hindu. These mean these essentially mean that uh, they are a political party in which um, has a specific goal in mind, whether it's a religious um, party to advance their religious ideology, or if they want independence from the from the current government, or if they're an alternandalist, with all which I, again I will go into detail in that political ideology video. I know you got a lot of you guys are like, what the hell is an alternandalist? Essentially, the best way to uh, summarize alternandalist is globalism. They they support globalism, but it's not the type of globalism that you're thinking about. That global is that they 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 believe that. An altermondalist, by the way, is a French word. It's it's it. This is more French than anything. Um, altermondalist is essentially they support globalism but hate the way that it is being executed as of right now. They don't think that it supports um, the common worker. They don't think it supports ecology. They don't think it supports um, a lot of different kinds of uh, things that they support. Essentially, it's like a weird combination between an ecologist and a socialist. That is the best way to to describe an ultramondalist. So if you guys are wondering, that's what an ultramondalist, again, it is a combination between socialism and uh, uh, ecologicalism and modern liberalism. Essentially what that is. So, um, so the difference between the Republican Party of Texas and the Committed Christians movement is that they, uh, the Republican Party of Texas, essentially the Republican Party of Texas as we know it, that is what they are, and they are the majority in Parliament as of right now. If you go over to the Committed Christians movement, they are an extreme right Christian movement in Texas. They want to advance themselves into um, things monitor just went off um they want to advance christianity they want to make christianity they're more if, if they were to get into a power it wouldn't be a maybe it wouldn't be a theocracy but it kind of would be a theocracy Wait, should i make texas a theocracy let me, let me know all right let's go ahead and go over here and terrorist group we have the boogaloo boys oh why are they a mexican drug cartel <laughs> right-wing democratic extreme right let's just make them extreme right um so we have week we will give them about five thousand armed ex no okay that's a lot let's give them two thousand armed extremists and about 500 mercenaries We have the Boogaloo Boys <laughs> as the um, uh, as a as a terrorist group in Texas, and then we will also make these. I, again, it's not doing what I wanted to do. Okay, so they have 300, 300 and tw 3,250 armed extremists and one hundred and fifty mercenaries. They're anarchists. Can you guys guess what they're going to be? Let's go over to customize game. Let's go to load. Let's go to groups. Let's go to political party. Let's go to national networks. And it says that they are right here. The anti-fascist movement or their abbreviation will be Antifa. Political pen tendency censor? No, they're not. They're not. They're not. They're not. They're not. RM, Russian Mafia, Chinese Mafia. Okay. 
centrist Antifa for the win. <laughs> Again, I need to go in and uh, add their add their uh, uh, logos. Texas again. We're gonna confirm. Go back. I like how like uh, whenever you load these now, whenever you load these in the modding tool, um, they actually um, like they, it actually doesn't like load for seven minutes. Like it, it it it's actually a lot better at loading now. So that's a that's a change right there. Republic of Texas organizations apparently they will be a part of the. Uh, I don't know how able to see what organization they're a part of, but we'll go in and we'll change that. And hang on. I think I just realized what. We may have been clicked as the United States that whole time. Let's go to the United States. Let's go to parties. Whoa, 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 whoa. Random dude, whoa. Jesus Christ. The stream is just out of whack right now. Protestant, 48. We do 56. Again, I'm clicking as the goddamn United States. I'm gonna end my life. Go back. Protestant. Let's go. Nine. Let's click on Texas. Protestant. Fifty-four. There we go. Texas have a crazy amount of oil in this game. I'm pretty sure they actually have a lot of oil, like right here, right around here. Um, they would actually have a lot. That's why. Okay, so let's go over here. Let's go over to A. Let's go to Abilene, and let's get rid of that. I don't know how it's doing that. The other, the only other thing that I've actually noticed is that the highways are going to be owned by the United States, and I don't know how to get rid of that. Add some non-in-game towns and infrastructure. I already am. So the cities that I have added, and again, this is a work in progress. This mod is a work in progress. I really need to go ahead and save all of this, and then. Um, uh, go ahead and get uh, start playing. Uh, essentially, the the cities that I've added in Texas right now. So we have Denton. Lubbock is already added. I added Amarillo. We have Abilene. Um, what I really want to do, I'm going to add, like, you know, Tyler, Nacogdoches, um, maybe some suburbs around Houston will be added. Uh, can you delete those highway and place new highways? I actually cannot. Not that I know of right now, again. This mod is a work in progress. Let's modify the world. So I see I have all of this. Networks. I can remove all high speed train lines, but it doesn't allow me to remove the highways. That's not. So save this one more time. Save completed. Let's quit. Go to bonus, go to modding, play a mod, game, Republic of Texas, and we're done. 
How long has been PG been trying to set up this mod? Um, yesterday. Uh, yesterday was the first time that I actually uh, started the mod. And that's how long I've been working on it. I've been working on it since last night. Is this going to be a short stream? Maybe not. Hopefully not. But I know of right now. I mean, I just spent like 25 minutes like going over the mod itself and then just kind of showing y'all everything. I was hoping for like an hour and a half, maybe two hours. And if anything, I mean, y'all can see me like edit the mod while I talk about other things. silo. Interactive mod making series. Sure. I have always wanted to do a mod. A mod series or something like that. That would be really cool. Oh my god. Random dude. Are you kidding me? Yeah, no, he's getting getting hidden. Yeah, that guy just got hidden. Let's look. So, Texas, Republic of Texas is a republic, obviously. Regime is presidential. Uh, political tendency, conservative rightist, 29 million people. Austin is the capital. Uh, 219,000 uh, square miles. One region, obviously. A temperate desert climate, $2.1 trillion. $2.1 trillion in uh, GDP. Uh, share of the global GDP is 2.18%. Uh, growth is 2.6% apparently, but <laughs> unemployment is 8.3%. Inflation is 1.4, and currency is equal to the dollar. It is the, uh, the Texas dollar, I guess we're going to call it. Um, debt ratio is 106.9%. GDP per capita is $74,000. Uh, army in soldiers is 140,000. Apparently, we have 28 nuclear weapons, and uh, elections are in 674 days. There are six, around 600 nukes stored in Texas. I don't think. No, see, no, Texas is not. It's, Texas is not um, a nuclear weapons state. We actually have, I think, th if if we're if we're storing nuclear weapons, the only reason that we are storing them is for um, the only reason that we're storing those weapons. Okay, so hang on, hang on, hang on. Texas. Okay. See, I don't know. I don't know why he keeps doing this. Hang on, let's try. Let's try. The only reason that that nukes would be stored in Texas is for dismantlement. That is the only reason because in uh, in Amarillo there is a facility not that far from downtown Amarillo in which it's 
uh, weapons are dismantled, but not in any way are they are they some are are they even being used. There's no ICBM silos in Texas, is what I'm trying to say. I don't know why I'm, ha I'm having a very hard time talking right now. CRC. I don't know why. I don't, I don't, I don't know why it keeps doing this. Like, CRC, the GOP, it's supposed to keep saying the Republican Party of Texas. Maybe because it keeps thinking. 4158. So let's let's go back one more time and then we will play. Not silos, just warheads. Yes. So they're being stored in Texas. They are not weaponized for Texas. Is most of our most of the US uh stockpile of nuclear weapons that are ready to fire at a moment's notice? are in places like Nebraska, in, uh, in the Dakotas, in Wyoming. Modify my Republic of Texas. Power and Revolution stories I want to play sometime. That was actually, there's a lot of lore. There's uh, references to me in uh, AMN and uh, Gabe Vogel is like is like the president of Brazil or whatever. <clears throat> Share the mod. I'll do that in the future. Parties. Party to for the defense of nature. Nope, that is United States or like like it has the United States. Parties. Republican Party of Texas. Democratic. Okay, so that is why. Maybe that's why. I meant to flip this around for some reason. Republican Party. Keeps getting confused, like, what the hell am I doing? Let's see what the US GDP is. What about the Chinese GDP? You make an independent Cape Republic with that, or Katunga? Where is the Cape? <clears throat> Let's look. I seriously don't know why. It does this. a bug. That's the fun part about about this game is just that it's a bug. But yeah. Let's say since Texas is a part of is an independent state, let's say the United States immediately acted upon modify the world annex let's find puerto rico that way they still have 50 states see so puerto rico is now a u.s state 
directly administered by the United States. So, for some reason, it's... Like, there's two... There's two of them. So if we, if we load... Groups... at the Republic of Texas, the Liberal Party, no, we're not looking at that, we're looking at this, so even then look how fast this loads, export, Retrieving his dream of Texas. Hell yeah. Okay. So modify diplomatic relations. Let's go to parties. What the hell? See? What is going on with this? League of Pioneering Democrats. No, you're going to be extreme right. You're going to be Christian. I'm doing something wrong here. Let's try this one more time. So we have the Republican Party of Texas. have 200 seats, 47. Is that 47? Republican Party. Oh my god, what is... Okay. So we'll reset 
this menu, okay. I'm so confused right now. Seats, gonna get this started in a second i'm just trying to get all this correct out okay let's go over to customize game load groups ccp oh wow okay we're gonna do democratic party of texas abbreviation is gonna be dem back over there go browse Democratic Party. Cool. There we go. Groups. National Networks. RCFR. Republic of Texas Front for Renewal. Now it's showing that it's that that's what they are. Modify. Anti-fascism. And center. No, they're not. Try to change that in a second. Go back over here. Patriotic front. Let's make them the loons. Religious congregation. Union. Association. anti-racism we're going to say black lives matter B-L-M. Comes <clears throat> a fine Christian constitutional monarchy. Hell yeah. Those from last elections to be assigned. I'll go in and I'll uh, change all of that. Parties. Power. Terrorists. Boogaloo Boys. 2000. Let's try that. Let's just delete these guys and add them again. So let's go. Anarchist. 1,500. 100. Customize. Load. Groups. National Networks. Opposition movement. See, see, the name is completely different every time.
Okay, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I'm, tr I'm done trying to do that. I'll figure it out later uh, whenever I'm not streaming. Otherwise, I'm just going to email Eversim and just say, Hey, this is not working. Play mod. God, that is so frustrating. Maybe I'll work with someone to try to fix it. <clears throat> you want to deal with an epidemic crime or health, the smartest and most effective and cheapest way to deal with it is prevention first. Bing Shitting. God, that is my favorite thing from John Cena. John Sheena. Bing Shitting. Oh, yeah, so, so. Bing Shitting. Texas. And it's doing it again. Oh my god, I'm going to kill myself. Maybe I have to e export it or something? Like, I don't get it. Let's just go. Let's see what we can do. <clears throat> and government to be made. Government to be made. I have an extremely large deficit. Oh my god. Danger zone. The lever of budget deficit concerns me a lot. Partners are not delighted that there are radical policies in the banks which are observing us with increasing suspicion. <laughs> Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Active terror networks. I believe these were supposed to be the, the... Yeah, this is supposed to be Antifa. Maybe we can knock down their, their power a little bit. Government be created. Let's go ahead and do that. Get him to appoint the entire government. <coughs> We will go over, company turnover. Let's do a massive tax on company turnover. Can you imagine a country? Like, we are. Uh, uh, <laughs> I feel like we're gonna. Our economy's gonna crash extremely quickly with this 15% deficit. Because we already have an extremely high uh, public debt right now. We have 117% public debt. Debt reimbursement accounts. Oh yeah, look at that. United States, we owe the United States $1.776 trillion. <clears throat> Republic of Texas. I wonder what this is going to be. Bugle of Republic of Texas. The head of the state's cabinet leader presents a new government to the, to the press in Texas. Anything on my, guide, my ungodly size deficit right now? Do 
Why can't I? Why can't I become a member? It says we're not able to set up pre pre pay payments. If you're using PayPal, I don't know. Like I, uh, that's. See, Boogaloo Boys works, but Antifa doesn't. I don't know why Antifa is not wanting to show up as. Mm. I don't know why Antifa is like just sh showing up like that. And I don't know why the Republican Party of Texas just keeps reverting back to the conformist right coalition. Many people. We are just waiting for that company turnover to pass. Then. <clears throat> Get some million dollars. Who's the leader of Texas? Uh, my boy Leslie Christian. Christian. Value added. Let's. Let's try value added tax, I guess. Oh, yeah, people will not like that. Revenue. I make $144 billion off of income tax. We would need to drastically reduce income tax in order to do that. You can say fucking shit now. Hell yeah! Hell yeah. Hey, thank you so much, Amen. <coughs> Sorry. Protests in Texas. Can I afford that? Oh my god. Hang on. I want to see this. 15. Oh, yeah. We need to, we need to think about increasing that. Yeah, let's do it by about that much. We really need to go back and uh, change that deficit. <laughs> Again, this mod is a huge work in progress. I'm still fine-tuning it. <clears throat> and again, guys, if you guys uh, want to join AMN, go ahead and support the channel in any way you can. Thank you so much, AMN, for supporting the channel. Well, and company turnover, the let's bill. go. Pretty sure that might actually... Okay, so that actually lowered my deficit to 11%, which is great. That is awesome. Maybe I should have gone for like 10% and then just lowered the company tax to like 15% or something. We also know economic growth will carry us just a tiny bit. We could also consider lowering that uh, income tax. The terrorist organization has nodded off. This is the least you can say. And, since we're doing nothing to wake them, the situation does not risk evolving, which is highly regrettable. It's highly regrettable that we're not fighting a terrorist organization. Religion? Protestant. Why are they Protestant? God damn it. Someone just said hi in the chat with a very interesting name. A lot to be known. Let's actually, let's actually start stepping up our... Um, maybe I should do the mod, like, if it's going to be an independent Texas. Maybe we should uh, do something uh, where, like, every state is independent. Completely collapsed United States, and then every state is independent of each other. 
maybe it's like some sort of confederacy where it's like a, they all have some sort of maybe like political military alliance or something. Yeah, the United States does look a little weird, doesn't it? <laughs> they're always used to they're always used to uh, them having Texas, and that was just kind of like one big bulge right here. What about here, let's go over to immigration. How many how many illegal immigrants do we have? One hundred eighty-five thousand. <coughs> Where he still plays did that did what how many of you guys found my channel through where he still plays e car ride right into 21st and 21st century style you know it's also funny we are only 20 years into the 21st century and we are now 22 years into the 21st century Conflict Boogaloo Boy is the terrorist organization. <laughs> Corbin Palicarn, what's up? What's up? What's up? Welcome back to the channel. I haven't seen you in a while. I don't know how I found you, to be honest. Good morning. Want to sell me wood? Two billion dollars worth of wood. Um, let's lower that price. We get you down to $1.106 per ton. Yeah, we'll accept that. Let's look, five years, $1.7 billion contract right here. Should I do Republic of Texas or should it just be Texas? I could actually do that. maybe Texas. Texas, that way, just in case someone wants to like change them into a theocracy, like they don't have to, they can just rename it themselves. Well, I mean, we can do Republic of Texas, and the, the game has, like, the built-in option for you to change. Change the name of the state. So, maybe I could just stick with the Republic of Texas for right now. And I will release this for you guys, if you guys... Well done! You have just... ...want to, uh, want to play the mod. Lower company tax to 18%. It'll increase our deficit just a tiny bit, but we're going to depend on that economic growth that it's going to create. We're going to deal with terrorism. Not yet. That is not the focus of this right now. This is just a preview of Texas. We still have a lot more work to do. <clears throat> Are you going to do a Hyperloop? I don't, I don't even think I have a Hyperloop discovered. Transportation. Yeah, I have a high-speed train. And if we actually zoom in again, you can see that m all of the infrastructure that is a part of Texas right now is all, it's all through. Um, it's all literally just uh, owned by the United States. Be a very interesting multiplayer match if that was possible in a game. Found PG on a forum with like two hundred people. Is that a Norwegian forum? Fabric, let's patent that. Farming. Are we at risk of going into a famine? GPS forum. Oh yeah. Um, I believe. Who were you on the forum? I forgot. Was it were you TNT? Or am I? I found PG when I was visiting his parents. Good God. And it is saving right now because I have quarterly saves on. 
unofficial geopolitical simulator forums. I miss those forums, man. I miss those forums so much. Yeah, Corbin Palakarn, um, yeah, that is a lie. AMN 92. Huh. God, I wish those forums, I miss those forums so much. Um, Corbin is a liar because he actually had a YouTube channel similar to mine. Uh, Corbin reared on. The bill has been. You guys actually remember Corbin reared on? You guys remember Corbin reared on? It was Corbin reared on. There was uh, there was someone else. Um, I'm forgetting his name right now. But if you remember back during the time, perspective analysis. I remember uh, Corbin actually had a lot more subscribers than me. He was a, he had a, he had a uh, a Israel series as uh, on a Masters of the World, and he had like maybe 800 subscribers or something like that. And I actually overtook him. So I believe, if I'm not wrong, I am the largest continuous. Uh, I'm the largest continuous um, geopolitical simulator player. Actually, no. Um, that is actually wrong because there's a French guy that continuously plays it, so he's the largest, so I believe I'm like the second largest. Natural pollution tax. Yeah, let's go. Multiplier would be fun. Yeah, there's a um there's a what do you call it? Fourth generation warfare. Fourth generation warfare? Uh, is essentially the uh, it's it's masters it's it's a, it's essentially this. I mean, it looks exactly like this. There's a lot more interactability, and then uh, it actually does have multiplayer. So, fourth generation warfare is kind of like a really. I really need to play uh, fourth generation warfare a little bit more because it's actually really interesting the way that the, the game mechanics work. I don't preview it enough on this channel. The American series done and Turkey one as well. Turkey is not done. America is. The Multimo. Okay, yeah, Multimo. I remember them. The bill. The bill has been voted on. The bill has been passed. PG is the largest English-speaking PNR streamer, streamer. Okay, yeah. That is correct. I'm the largest English Karen Revolution. Prospective analysis. The prepar preparations are complete. The whole country is waiting for this. If anyone would like to help me on this mod, give you credit in the description of the mod. Can't grow your channel by only parent revolution, that's true. Yeah, that's why I'm expanding out. Going back to the political process. Um, other games too. Just a lot been going on. The largest English speaker on his street who plays Power and Revolution. Our fiscal performance Whoa. in the last quarter is... Whoa. Oh, God. $60 billion worth of debt. That is... Oh, God. Yikes. Yikes, 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 yikes. Yikes. That is a big yikes. Public deficit is... Budget deficit is $266 billion. That just increased our public debt to 122%. And we incurred... About 
nearly $10 billion, over $10 billion from the United States. So we're borrowing a huge chunk of money from the United States. And we will assume that the debt that we owe the United States was essentially us buying out our independence to them. The bill That's has... actually why it makes a lot of sense for the for uh, an, an independent Texas to uh, have a lot of debt, especially more than our GDP is worth. Mainly because if you're going to buy yourself out, Texas probably would be able to buy itself out because they give probably the most back to the federal government uh, than the government spends on them. Um, and so that's one of the be one of the interesting things about an independent Texas is that their financial situation would be pretty difficult. They're just going to reintegrate you when your country collapses. I actually might try to do see if there's an event for that. For me to do that. Like if... Uh, Whenever there's a game over or something like that, or a financial ruin, like it basically says, like, uh, well, the experiment, experiment tried, and then we failed. Angola. <laughs> Where's our weapons going to be coming from? It's also really cool. We have like cities like. Huh, Abilene's actually not showing up. I know. Yeah, the new cities that I'm putting in, their names are not showing up. Again, a lot of work in progress. Lots of work in progress. Damn, I've only been streaming for an hour. Can't you boost oil exports to cover the deficit? I probably could. We actually have not seen what my oil production is. Over here. I'm actually going to have to step away from the computer for a second. Uh, uh, once I check. This. Oil production, 101 million tow to 126. And an oil. You're actually short. But we could actually boost production. We are, we, we are able to do that as Texas. Because if you actually, I'm going to have to uh, make a new dedicated video to this because there is actually a shit ton of oil. I can, by the way, I can say uh, I need to know everything. I know. Hey, Grab Rangoon, if you want to help me on this mod, I would love your help. Um, there's a shit ton of oil from like south of Fort Worth all the way over here to Mexico. So where, if you can see my mouse right here. So here's the Dallas-Fort Worth area right here. This is called the Metroplex. So from the Metroplex, all the way down here, especially where Fort Worth is, it kind of like makes this line right here. So imagine like this, this line that just moves right here. It's either right, like right here where Austin is, or kind of got like then south toward where Laredo is. So it's a uh, the best way to reference it is the metroplex dallas fort worth right here all the way down where austin and san antonio are and then where laredo is and then in between laredo and corpus christi so right here there's a shit ton of oil right here and if you actually um know your uh areas your your basins or whatever right here where el paso is so just east of el paso 
where the where this river right here is. This is called the Permian Basin. This is actually a real oil field that is still being exploited as of right now. There's actually one oil well right here. So let me actually grab some, oh, nuclear electricity accounts for 21%. So let me grab some oil wells. I'm not gonna place them right now. Very weak, wait. Where's the Permian Basin? Okay, so the Permian Basin is not there. Check that later. There's no way this is very weak. Oh, shit. Okay, this is assuming that you have shale. We'll say that. Let's look. Right here? Okay, so right here, South Texas. Right where the border of Mexico is. Is very good. So let's go back to the Permian Basin. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So that's all shale. So regular oil, you're going to have a really hard time finding, but shale oil is really what you want. So the Permian Basin is full of oil. Let's go up to Amarillo. So yeah, very weak. This right here, right around here, is called the Permian Basin. And that's where you're going to find a shit ton of oil. Then, right around here, so let's look. Oh my god. <laughs> the Boogaloo Boys set up a base. The Boogaloo Boys, no, the Boogs. The Boogs are here. The Boogs have a, <laughs> they're gonna invade the Dallas Fort Worth area. Okay, let's look. So we have good, and I'm pretty sure you can find a crap ton of oil right around here. Okay, so we have average. So it's gonna be right. Yeah, okay, so we're, we're talking South Texas. Apparently there's some average readings right around here. I'm really gonna try to get them to uh, add a oil map in this next edition. We really need an oil map. But if you want any other information on this, AMN has actually made a really cool map that I posted on Reddit. So go to Reddit and then find my oil map that I made. Boys are already ready. Boys. The boogs. The boogs. Let's do some reconnaissance. God, they are moving troops right now across the state. We are going to attack this country. Ah! Let's send some troops. We need to get them to use this. So long as we don't attack these highways, we're not going to go to war with the United States. You release this mod, is it going to be... Is it possible to play as the opposition like other countries? Uh, I don't know. Maybe not. I don't think you can do that as a mod. I've never tried that. I also barely play with the modding tool. This is the first time I've actually, like, dedicated myself to playing with the modding tool. So, um... Oh, there, there. Oh. Uh, oh god, they're going after my... <laughs> oh god, they're going after my my uh, renewable energy. Oh no, they're going after Austin! Shit, we need to reinforce them. We gotta, we gotta send... We gotta reinforce them with troops from Port Hood. So that's Antifa. Okay, so yeah, we are going to, uh... We're gonna... Lower those. That way they are not building bases in my state. Because they are, they are really building on bases right now. Oh. So 
the more you know. They only have one Air Force base, which is called Dias. Actually, I'm going to... So we actually... Okay, so we have Nellis. Uh-oh. Our frontal attack against the enemy units which have ventured into our territory has had the effect of repulsing them. And these cowards... The Battle of the Lone Star Wind Farm. The rest of the United States must look with horror when Texas tears itself apart. Would that actually be interesting? Look at this, Texas. Texas is independent, and then there's already a civil war. 252 Texans have died, and 100 terrorists have died. Pose a peace treaty. Can we... End up hostilities and standardization. Yeah, they're just going to be a regular terrorist group. Maybe the Boogs could uh, could be the only, only one. You know how this will help? Let's go over to Justice. So many guys you see. Unrestricted sale to adults. And the Democrats actually support it. <laughs> Protests. In a country supporting freedoms, everyone should have the right to defend his or her life and property. For let there be no mistake, the criminals in society are armed. It is due to this conviction, fellow citizens, that I propose to relax the laws on arms sales. We owe this to our children. I'm actually going to upload a very high quality flag of uh, Texas. Pacifist sympathizers are demonstrating as we speak. We are supervising the demonstration at... We are just a hub for terrorism right now. Perspective and... United States right now. I know, right? I think I'll actually, I'll, I'll also allow the United States to be playable. That way, if you play as the United States, you can reintegrate Texas into the Union. Perspective. God, I'm I'm gonna have so much fun with this with this uh, mod. I can't wait to release it to you guys. I'll even make a dedicated video about it. The terrorist, or the terrorist organization is not at off. LMAO, nice dad. I know, right? Can't you boost? Yeah. Okay. So we could actually just invest a crap ton of money into uh oil what i'm gonna do i'm gonna go ahead and step away from the computer for a minute and i will uh be right back
All right, guys. Um, I'm going to go ahead and uh, wrap this stream up here. Um, I do want to go ahead and do a another part of this. Again, this is not going to be like a stream series. This is literally going to be just me working on this mod most of the time. Um, but uh, thank you guys so much for actually being interested in this. I'm really excited to see what the future of this mod will be. And I can't wait to re uh, release it to you guys. But um, uh, something else did come up ju uh, just now. So I need to go ahead and uh, uh, wrap the stream up. So if you guys like this, go ahead and leave a like. Subscribe to the channel if you are new. If you guys want to see more content like this, hit that bell notification icon so you don't miss anything on this channel whenever it does happen. And if... Uh, uh, you guys want to see more Republic of Texas, please let me know, but I'm actually really excited for this mod if it works I mean, there's a couple of things that I'm trying to uh, Make happen like like uh, this little bug right here. Why Antifa is not showing up. I need to reduce the power of the god dang uh, 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 Boogaloo boys and uh, Antifa or whatever Jesus Christ or even like active terrorist networks in the country and we actually even have a battle with them just now over a wind farm but guys go ahead and leave a like subscribe to the channel if you are new if you guys like this hit the bell notification icon and i'll see you guys in the next one thank you guys so much for watching this join the discord i'll see you guys in the next one thank you so much for watching and take care